Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 7 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about delete record using Ajax. In last two video, we have seen how to insert and update the record using Ajax in Laravel 7. Now let's see how we can delete the record using Ajax. So for that, switch to the project and uh, just open the student.blade.php file. So just go inside resources, then views and open the student.blade.php file and uh, here first of all create a link here so inside this td this link for edit and now click a link for the delete ok so just write here anchor tag href javascript colon void okay and uh, class add the button class so let's write here btn btn then there okay and here just add the text delete all right now let's create a function inside the controller so just go to the app directory then http then the student controller okay and here just create a function for deleting a record so just write here public function and function name let's say function name is create delete a student okay and just pass here the id all right dollar student equal to a student colon colon find and just pass here the id okay dollar student arrow delete okay it will delete the record now simply return a response and response as a JSON so just write here JSON and inside this JSON past an array success and just write here the message the record has been deleted okay now save this controller and uh, now let's create the route for this method this function so go to the web.php file inside the routes directory just open web.php and here just create a route and method delete so just write here delete and URA in students will also pass the parameter id okay then a student controller and rate function name which is delete a student so just copy and paste here also add the name so just write here arrow name and provide the uh, route name so let's say route name is a student dot delete all right now save this file now go to the student dot blade dot php file and here just create a javascript function okay so just closing just before the closing body tag just add a script tag and here create a function so just write here function function name let's say function name is delete is student okay and here just pass the id now uh, first of all confirm the uh, uh, confirm the click so just write here if confirm do you really want do you 
really want to delete this record okay. if yes in this right here dot dollar dot eject and uh, inside this pass the object with this our url and url it is students concatenation sign id okay request type type uh, colon delete okay and uh, pass the token so just write here data underscore token colon dollar input name is equal to underscore token all right dot global success then call this callback function function response okay and uh, simply uh, simply remove the this row the uh, deleted row so just uh, what is the id just add the id this id okay and id so here dollar s is id plus concatenation sign id dot remove okay now save this file now add this function to the deleted uh, delete link so inside this table just add here on click and uh, paste here the function name delete a student and inside this just pass here the student id okay so inside the double curly bracket dollar is student arrow id all right now save this file and all set so let's check it so switch to the browser and go to the url slash student and here you can see the delete button okay now click on delete link i'm just going to delete this record so click on delete this is the confirmation do you want to really do you really want to delete this record if i click on cancel it's not deleted okay and if i click on delete and just click on confirm and okay and uh, it's not deleting check what is the problem so go to the console and if i click on delete then okay uh, not for now not found let's check the url it's students and here the student spelling is correct delete a student url with students okay Just add the slash here all right now save this file and uh, let's refresh the page now just click on uh, delete link 
okay and you can see delete has been recorded uh, deleted okay now just delete this one so click on delete and here you can see record deleted so in this way you can delete record using ajax laravel 7 so that's all about delete record using ajax so thanks for watching this video and if you are still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching